but I'm just logging this local onto the automation software and to do it you've got to profile it you don't have to but if you profile each loco it'll stop much more precisely on the you know on the spot in an exact spot regardless of what sort of motors in it or how long it is uh, as long as you put the measurements in and then you do a profiling run this is what it's doing at the moment it's going backwards and forwards along three sections of track which are monitored on occupancy detectors and on the middle section it's where it does the calculations on the middle run of track and it has a, a runoff section either side which it's doing now it's running off then going back again it's speeding up and up and going faster and faster until it's done all the calculations required to log it onto the software and for it to work nicely going in and out of station say and stopping in an exact spot